This is breaking news. A voice contestant sang fancy in front of Reba Misentire, and the country queen had the most Reba reason ever for doing it differently. The Voice season 26 continues on the 2024 TV schedule, with Snoop Dogg and Reba Mcentire's teams taking the stage for Monday night's playoffs. The coaches didn't have to go it alone, bringing in advisors to help their team, and Snoop made a pretty bold move by bringing in not a fellow music icon, but rather Olympic gymnast Simone Biles, a choice that admittedly confused me. However, what was arguably an even bolder move came when he assigned one of his team members the song Fancy to sing in front of Miss Entai herself, and the Queen of Country had the most on-brand reaction to the performance. Last week we saw Gwen Stefani make the difficult decision of choosing just two of her remaining five artists to represent her in the upcoming live shows. Before making his own cuts, Snoop Dogg really challenged his team members with songs by artists including Whitney Houston, Prince, and yes, Reba Mcentire. Kristen Eagle was given fancy, and she put her own spin on the classic tune, which also included some sassy hip swinging. Mcentire beamed through the whole performance, giving Eagle a standing ovation before raving. Really? Oh my gosh, that was incredible. I love the way you changed it around. Your choreography was great. You were passionate about it. Wonderful, wonderful job. Michael Bubbly then jokingly inquired if Reba Mcentire also did the hip thing when she sang that song on stage, which inspired the most Reba response as she said, No, no, I get a catch in my get along if I do that. Can't do it. Apparently, I don't live in the part of the country where one gets a catch in their get along. Or maybe this is just a Rebaism like when she quotes Sir Mix a lot by saying, Oh my God, Becky. But either way, that was a new one for me. The other voice coaches were flawed as well. And Rebum Sentai doubled down by saying, I'm telling you, sexy Mimo, can't do that no more. Michael Bubbly previously held my favorite moments from this season of The Voice by using Titanic and other movie plots to try to earn favor with the artists. But I've got to say, hearing Rebum Sentai refer to herself as sexy Mimo, is just something you don't come back from. In the end, Christina Eagle's fancy performance rose to the top, as she was one of the two singers Snoop Dogg chose to bring to the live semifinals. See her winning rendition of the song below. Call me crazy. But I bet Reba Mtentire's still got some hip action left in her get along, or something like that. Regardless, the hard part is over for her and 75% of the voice coaches with only Michael Bublé left to eliminate three from his team. Tune in to see the top eight rounded out at 9pm ET Tuesday, November 26, on NBC.